Admission, admission, March and September 2019 intakes. Wetum University is an online university affiliated to Al Madina International University, Malaysia. Its offices are located in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, and VGC Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria. Available programs are financial technology, cybersecurity, networking, IT, human resource management, and a whole lot more. How to apply? Visit www.wou.edu.ng and click on Apply Now. Then download the admission form, checklist form, and program form. Email the completed application form to admission at wou.edu.ng or info at wou.edu.ng. Benefits, it is cheaper, being taught by experts all across the world. Admission requirements, Canadian and Australian grade 12, Nigerian certificates, Cambridge IGCSE and A-level, American SAT, Malaysian SPM and STPM or any other international grade 12 equivalent. For more information or on available programs, visit www.wou.edu.ng or call plus 601 or 080-381-71586. right, yes, welcome back to the Balanced Idol Teletainment. Of course, with that intro where you don't see so, you could not say uh, this next level, now something really very important. Now, when you're talking about education for inside our country, right now, we they try to make sure say, we feel retrace our steps and we feel to do it, we feel to give the best where they are available. And that's now where we get this very cadet guest in the building. Inside the studio with me, now the president, of um, of the, the university where you just see so we actually we see, we just played the promo and in name now Professor Doctor Abdul Wahab Idris Deji. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Hmm. With this morning, title where you get now, no single be title where they just they pick up for road. You're a professor and you're a doctor. Um, which specialty did the doctorate is? Uh, engineering, electrical, and computer engineering. Electrical and and computer, uh, computer engineering. engineering. Yes. Beautiful. So now you would they talk about the university? Um, tell us about this university. Okay, with some universities, an online university based in Malaysia and also affiliated to other university. And the university has uh, <coughs> courses that are today's world's courses like financial technology, cyber security, and a whole lot more course, uh, programs. So we, uh, we got initiated and inaugurated in 2017. We founded the university in 2017. <coughs> And uh, ever since there, we've been progressively moving forward. And we're capturing everyone and everywhere in the world, in Europe, in America, in Asia, Malaysia, Singapore, and every other part of the world. Now we're reaching out to Africans. We feel this is the time to take education to the doorsteps of people in Africa. The route education we had during our days is no longer what the world is going the direction the world is going right now. So we, we're looking at digital education, education where people can be, become entrepreneurial in, in nature. And the part of the world we live in, we're complaining a lot of uh, 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 no jobs, uh, unemployment issues, and so many other challenges that we have. The, the problem is that many of our youths are not trained to actually pick up something and develop something on, the, on their own. So we have come up with an education, a digital education platform that enable people to invent and innovate new ideas and pioneer them for the next developmental changes. Beautiful. I like this one where you talk because even one of the courses where actually pick my interest where you mentioned that cyber security. Now we know out in the recent past, I mean, for America, we hear how they take oh, in the number of Nigerians where they say they do yahoo yahoo. And um, even for, for, for Nigeria here, the amount of money where ESSC don't recover from those people was about ni 974 million naira. Now every waiting will be even here. Over 900 million naira will be ESSC. They don't actually recover from people where they do cyber, um, cyber yahoo yahoo, or aka yahoo plus or Yahoo Ginger, or any name way people they call them for outside. And um, we'll not say so, for courses like this, I go like ask now, since now digital platform, how people go feed do the practical part? Because we'll not say for Nigeria here, a lot of the higher institution is all about theory, theory, theory. How, can you explain to us how okay. the practical part could be achievable? Okay, uh, thank you very much. Uh, the fact remains that <laughs> in today's world, most of the things we do, we use software. We develop software to run our programs, whatever we want to do. Most of the courses like cyber security, the practical actually develop simulation programs, programs that software will run for you. 
So what we do as an online digital platform is to develop software that will run programs for whatever we want to do. And for anybody studying uh, courses like cybersecurity, financial technology, which is methodology for uh, blocking the, uh, the wastage in money, financial issues, developing technology to enhance financial transaction. So this kind of program is actually for people to start to learn how to program a software that can enable transaction easily or to block uh, transactions that are not, that are, that are be seen to be not certified in such a way or in that direction. So what, what we do is to train people to develop, to learn how to use software. And this software, on their own, they can start a company or a business that will enable the big companies out there, the big players, give the big player platform that this that you're doing, we can help to block or to stop or to protect your system. We can develop a system that will protect your system so that you cannot easily be hacked. You cannot easily be, be just opposed, just like that. So we are looking for the next economical development because the next world uh, the, econ the economy will be based on, it will be a knowledge-based economy. It, it's not longer going to be the, about oil, about, if you see the things that we used to know or we used to do, they're gradually fizzing it out. So the, the world is advancing, to in, it, 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 it going in a different direction. And we don't want our people to be left behind. We, we, we seriously don't want. So we want to train people using software in all methodology, in all, the practical you've talked about is actually <laughs> training them on how to use simulations. Beautiful, because um, right now we don't see a lot of um, a lot of countries are moving ahead, ahead. So this is one of the developments we would see when they bring come the African soil, which is a very beautiful thing. What would be the vision and mission or objective where the university gets for Africa? Big, our big mission or vision, our big vision for, for, for the African continent is that by 2035, we, 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 we hope in this part of the world we would have been so advanced that we would have created more entrepreneur than any other, any, other, any other continent on the planet. We would have been able to reach out to so many people who will in turn train others and make this country one of the fastest growing conti continent, this continent one of the fastest growing continent on, on, on the globe. So we, we, we're looking at the new generation, the next phase of Africa, how it's going to look like. People to pioneer the change that we're talking about. People to take on the leadership mantra that we're talking about. People to be bold enough to create new ideas and new, these ideas that are based on, that will drive the economy. People that will be in forefront, the entrepreneurial idea. People, we, we really want to, we are focusing on training new entrepreneurs that will mm. take on the, the leadership of uh, tomorrow. Beautiful. Now, I would like, before I ask you um, how people feel apply, um, some people there in the school of thought, they believe, say, um, university or education in general puts you in a box. Um, what do you feel do to actually change the mindset? What do you feel, to, what, what's your opinion on, with that, on that statement, that, that university education, whether not primary, secondary, or even university, puts you in a box? The reason, the, because they mention people like the Steve Jobs, he didn't have to get, finish his university, the Melinda Gates, they didn't have to be professors, all due respect, sir. Yeah. A, lot of this, a lot of the richest people when we get around the world, no need to get certain titles. So some people believe, say, education puts you in a box. Is that true? Uh, it, somehow, yes or no. I'm going to look at it from both sides, so both, both, both ways. You know, to be honest, you, you just mentioned people from an advanced environment. You know, you remember that these people in their primary school, they started doing coding, programming. In primary school, in secondary school. If you go to Japan, kids in primary school, they programming robots. They develop robots. You know, if you have had such education all along the line as, as you were growing up, you had, you've gone through a series of development like this. I think by, at secondary level, when you finish your grade 12, you, you're ready to start something. You're ready. You've got it what you needed to, to, to create a life, the, the new world that, that we want to see. But it's quite different from the kind of education we had during our days or we, we, we have it in this part of the world. That's why we want to revolutionize the educational system the way it is right now. We, we're saying that the things that will prepare you, that will take you out of the box, that will make you think out of the box, 
are not in our educational system. If you look sometimes ago, a while ago, you see some of the big multinational companies, they're saying that Nigerians are not employable. Mm. Uh, they are not employable. The, the graduates, our graduates from our universities skills. are not employable. So they need to go through a series of training in order for them to be able to cope in the working environment. Uh, somehow they may, they, they may have their, their, their ground, but the fact remains that we have not actually systematically reviewed our curriculum to, to meet today's needs. We, we're just like doing the same thing over and over again, and these things are completely outdated. I remember when I was traveling overseas, I, I, I took my taraji after graduating, had, having my first degree in electrical electronics engineering. I took my big taraji, it's a big book in electrical, for those who study engineering, they, they know, they, we call it the electrical bible. And uh, I took it overseas. I was so proud. I, I, I've got it what it takes to, to, to excel in this program, in my master program then. But on God's day, I found that the book was totally, totally outdated. That my professors were telling me that they didn't even use the book. It's way long ago. So we are still doing the things that are of the past. We're doing the things of the past. We're, we're not conventional enough right now as it is. So we need to. We need to bring it down. We need to narrow it down to what it is seriously and yes. face the scope, today's scope, what, what, what people are doing right now. All right. Now, um, so tell us, so far so good, in the past one year, how the reception on the, um, in ter terms of people showing interest in the university? It's been very vibrating. It's been, it's been nice, especially in the, in the Europe. You know, uh, for, for most of them, they don't want to be in the box that you mentioned, that exactly. they, the education put people in the box. So they want to have, they want to have online, they want to study online, they want to have education, but it, it, they want to in, in their own way, in a way that they can do other things. Exactly. You can be because studying and be progressing in whatever aspect mm -hmm. of life that you're facing. So the same thing will bring it to this place. In Europe, we've had a lot, a lot of people joining us a lot of, in terms of investment, in terms of students, in terms of everything that we, 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 we're looking out for. But in this part of the world, it, it, it came to, 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 to the management that, yeah, you're an African, you need to take this to your... your, your, your so your how people, people feel actually apply? Because now I know some people, they watch your house, and some people will really want to get more information about um, the university and how, um, and the, the scorecard, or will I say, the record on how consistent they don't do in other countries, just as you talk. So how do they apply for admission? Okay, it's easy. If you want to apply for admission, you just go to our website, www.wou.edu.ng, www.wou, with some online university, wou.edu.ng. Okay. And uh, you order admission, you just go to admission application form, download it, uh, fill it, and send it back to admission at wou.edu.ng. Right. Admission at wu.edu.ng. You email back to us within two, 24 hours or 48 hours, we'll get back to you. If we go through your WIAC, especially for those with WIAC, we just verify your result online. And once your result is authentic, then we, we, we offer you an admission. Beautiful. Thank you so much. All right. And I don't hear I'm already from the president of the university, it, it, um, the university itself. This is not Professor Dr. Abdul Wahab Idris Deji. We're inside the studio with me. I need to come out tell us so many things about the university and a digital educative platform. Am I correct, sir? Yes. Yes. yes and a very a digital platform where you fit to go school. Why you they do what you they do? Very important because now everybody they very busy and a convenient thing for you to do because the courses where they get now courses where they very practical. So already they get a way to make sure say the practical aspect it is fully covered. So just in case you they fear you they think say you know get that experience that one it they well catered for for them. Thank you so much, um, Doctor Professor Doctor Abdul Wahab um, Idris Deji. But get any social media handle we wanna get people feel actually full on top because now this age is digital. Yeah, seriously, <laughs> uh, we have uh, uh, in Instagram it's Wisdom underscore University. Okay. On Facebook it's just Wisdom University. Mm. On uh, YouTube it's Wisdom University. Beautiful. And then on Twitter it's Wisdom U. Okay. Wisdom U. All right. So they, they, and there are numbers like. Already displayed uh, yes. plus in Malaysia plus six zero one one three nine zero five one zero nine one. Beautiful. Plus six zero one one three nine zero five one zero nine one. All right. In Nigeria uh, zero eight zero three eight one seven one five eight six zero eight zero 
3817151586. So okay. these are the numbers to call. And sometimes we sometimes we even send admission form to people through WhatsApp via WhatsApp. Wow. Yes. Beautiful. So once they reach any of the number, because the numbers are WhatsApp, once they reach any of the number, we send admission application form to people via WhatsApp. Thank you so much for giving us so much information about the university. We wish you all the very best um, for inside this endeavor. All right, now, so we'll see how I'm on top of this particular segment. Right now, we get another interview. Um, who will be the person who we interview this time around? Now, what about him? If I be you, I'll go stay tuned to watch this interview. Stay with us. An education in the 21st and 22nd century that will gradually take us away from classroom while building global network of people, power, connections, and a marketplace. Imagine an education beyond the four walls of a classroom and without limitations, restrictions, and confinement that prepares you for the lifelong challenges that become opportunities for inventions, innovations, creations with different career paths, and entrepreneurship. Imagine such education with support from global networks of universities, industries, laboratories that will enable you to build friendship, internationalization, and globalization. This type of education will ultimately change our destiny forever while changing the world. This type of education creates a purpose not only for oneself but also with our friends, families, communities and eventually humanities. This is the future of education that Whitesum University has launched. Whitesum University, which is an affiliate of Medina International University, is the smartest way to study and work or study while doing business. Admission, admission, March and September 2019 intakes. Wetum University is an online university affiliated to Al Madina International University, Malaysia. Its offices are located in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia and VGC Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria. Available programs are financial technology, cybersecurity, networking, IT, human resource management and a whole lot more. How to apply? Visit www.wou.edu.ng and click on apply now. Then download the admission form, checklist form and program form. Email the completed application form to admission at wou.edu.ng or info at wou.edu.ng. Benefits, it is cheaper, being taught by experts all across the world. Admission requirements, Canadian and Australian grade 12, Nigerian certificates, Cambridge IGCSE and A-level, American SAT, Malaysian SPM and STPM or any other international grade 12 equivalent. For more information or on available programs, visit 